Paremnir. Remember me? This is Patil Tutunjian coming to you from Yerevan. It's been two weeks. I even forgot how to use the selfie stick. Why, why, why has it been two weeks? So after I last made the video or did the live talking about how I got sick, went to the hospital, and I got better, well, I got the flu. So I think my immunity system has gone down. So anyway, I got the flu. I'm much better now. Um, I wanted to take some time off to reboost my immunity system. Uh, I drank some ginger, lemon, garlic, eating garlic. I don't know. I've been trying things. Anyway, I went to the pharmacy, got some herbal-based medication, which really helped. I'm back now. Might some, take some pauses here and there, but I'm good. I'm back. I think my YouTube algorithm has been really suffering because I haven't posted in two weeks. So if you can please like this video and subscribe if you haven't already, that would super, super help me rebuild it and reach more people and build this community. I want to say thank you to everybody who stuck around when I was gone and people who reached out and wished me well and checked in on me. Um, it means a lot. Like you guys have been amazing. I got so many comments and people still were watching and rewatching the old videos so really really thank you so much i need to get used to back i need to get used to again to people staring at me as i walk around and film anyway uh and some channel news that literally nobody cares about what is happening with my hair i've been trying to learn how to french braid so i've been practicing now seeing myself in the video i'm like what was i thinking Maybe I'll get better at it. I'm still wearing the same shirt. I got a new fanny pack from Vernissage. And also, I got red Converse to cheer myself up. And yes, you can get Converse in Armenia. Don't ask me if it's real or not, I really don't know. They were $30. If you're looking for Converse in Armenia, there's a store called 360 Shoes on Pushkin and Mashtots, and they have them. So, it's available. And speaking of fashion, what are we doing today? So we're going to the closet sale organized by Marbe and Elina Sarkisian. You'll remember Elina uh, from my previous videos. She's my friend who came with me on many adventures. So you will recognize her. We'll do some interview with them. They are doing a closet sale to promote the idea and the culture of sustainable fashion. Plus the profits from this, not profits, the proceeds. Yeah, the profits from the proceeds from I just mixed two words. I think I forgot how to speak English in this past two weeks. Um, the proceeds are going to support Artsakh family. So it kind of like checks off a lot of boxes. So I wanted to go and support and film and promote this idea. And speaking of sustainable fashion, uh, I will also include in this video places where you can donate clothing because something that happens a lot for when people come to visit Armenia, whether you're coming for two weeks, three weeks, few months coming to volunteer coming to work you end up you know buying stuff and then your luggage is no longer enough to bring all your clothes back and people always wonder where can I donate the clothes or what should I do with them so I will include some links in the description of this video of places where you can donate your clothes when you're leaving Armenia in case you need it I think that's a good thing to do with them okay I'm gonna walk down Yusuf Sain the place where they're holding this event is called Art Space, which I've never been to, but I checked out their Instagram and it looks pretty cool. So I'm excited to go see it. We're gonna go down from Houston Time, which is Northern Avenue, and then we're gonna turn on Pushkin, which is where this place is. Okay, let's go.
Well, this is new. You see a lot of varieties of Sup Spider-Man on Northern Avenue, but a Minion is a new one. We are here. They're super busy with customers. I'm just gonna wait for them to clear up and then we'll talk to them. The usual mirror shot. <laughs> We're gonna get a tour now by Elina. Oh. Oh, I'm ready. You're ready? Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's let's back up, I guess. <laughs> no, it's okay. You can, no. So, so, first of us, first of us, first of all, tell us how did this collaboration come to life? Uh, I met Marve at a common friend's house. Marve is a jazz singer in Armenia. And uh, she said like she has so many stuff that she doesn't fit her anymore, very good quality stuff, and she doesn't know what to do. So I go, you know what, let's do like a closet sale. And instead of just throwing away, we can give the money to like a, a, a fund, like a kind of fundraising event or like a charity to one of the organizations to help Artsakh families. And that way, it's, it's a fun idea. People get to learn about like sustainable fashion not to mm -hmm. throw away and then reuse stuff that are really good quality, good brands and you know, uh, and I guess the idea is very new here in Armenia, but I think people are loving it and we've like, we, we just did it for two days to try out and it seems like a lot of people are coming and getting stuff. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, so basically that's how it, how it came together. So and you have a background in fashion. Yes, I do. You're a fashionista. <laughs> I see how like everything is so color coordinated. And yeah, there's the yellow the setup. Blue. Yeah, it's the setup is my job, like how to set up things and helping customers like to you know find things that suit them in their style and you know the prices are really cheap, not expensive. So it's. Uh, you know, suitable for people just to buy it and like uh, help a cause and you know, get beautiful stuff. And uh, on my way here, I was mentioning about sustainable sh fashion. I think it's so important to kind of bring that culture and promote it more yes. and more. Yeah. Um, so I we have so much fast fashion and people exactly. get to like just buy without thinking about what they're buying. This way, you know, uh, you are re kind of recycling your products. Every anybody can do this and yeah. you know, you're tired of your clothes, they're good quality. Uh, why not someone else would revive that piece and wear it again? I'm going to include your contact information. Uh, I mean, people already know you and they know your Instagram, but I'm going to include it again thank in case you. someone wants to do this. Thank you didn't you. tell me to do this, but I'm just going to do it. Uh, thank you, Fatih. Like, this is so amazing. Thank you for coming. Of course. Oh, my God. I need to shop. So, okay, let's start here. Okay. I saw some things, but you know my style. Yeah, you know my style. This is not your section. This is, but there's this is one thing. Issue, but there's this one thing. Yes. That's really cute. See, like, for example, something like this is like 2,000 drums. It's really that's cheap. That's amazing. It's brand new. It's really, like, probably not even worn. It's like this is your style. This Very is so, stylish. I'm definitely also, taking this. I have to mention that Marbe's stuff are there are a lot of made in Armenia stuff that mm -hmm. she has. Like she has, for example, this guest. It's an Armenian made in Armenia brand. Wow. So like you know, she she's got a lot of made in Armenia. Come, stuff. come in the video. And Say here is Marbe. Marbe, please come in. <laughs> and then we have like all the nice. People are running away from my shots. Here we have all the nice like wedding or like nightgowns and stuff that Marbe probably just won once for like an event or something. This is by Hedy, for example. This is Marbe, our beautiful, amazing, talented uh, jazz artist. Singer. So yeah, this is for example Pedur again. We have like again other brands again Pedur. This wow. is like original. Like uh, it has its shorts with it, and you know it's a nightgownish kind of thing. But people can dress it up in different ways. And then you know we have some brand bags here. For example, we have some like really good quality Valentino. So you can buy. You said that so casually. Like real <laughs> Valentino. <laughs> Valentino boots. And then I'm gonna take you. We have some like funky jewelry. Yesterday, so many people got like these kind of sunglasses or something. They're so in. This, they these are so I don't know if I can pull them off, oh, but they're okay. so in. They are. And then, uh, and I want to talk about this place. It's an yes. amazing place. 
uh, the artist's name is Harwood and he was so generous to give it to us just for free to use the space. It's uh, uh, like they preserved this place not to tear it down and they turned it into an art space. Hence the place is called Art Space. <laughs> I'll show you guys inside too in a second. This is your section. This is my section and a lot of blues. I wear a lot of blues. Yeah, I think this is you. That's so me. With like jeans on the at the bottom. And then you got I'm this. Yeah, I like, like the color. I want this. So yeah, we, you know, I know your style. And then... Uh, I, I also love these blue shoes, but I don't think they're my size. Yeah, these ones. These ones? Also, I don't know where, where I'll wear them, but... Seven. They would be cute with like shorts, yeah. like jean shorts, this and that white top on here. Oh my god, now I want it. Okay, she, she has a skill <laughs> for it. These are like brand new, for example, they're like made uh, especially for Marbe, but she never wore them for oh. an event. Oh, wow. Yeah, like they're custom made. For example, here we go, another Armenian brand, Pedur. You know, this, this style is so in. Like, I'll link uh, Pedur's uh, website too in the yeah, description so people can and check it out. She has like brands that we don't have it here in Armenia, like Kos. Mm -hmm. the italian brand very simple stuff so yeah i love it. it and uh, i think we can also go inside to show some of the artwork yes let's for harut yes let's that. just to promote his art too yes so here is harut's art studio he has lots of students who come and take lessons as well from him how to mm -hmm. paint these are all his paintings I'm gonna do like a slow. Yeah. <laughs> Behind the scenes of them giggling, <laughs> happy um, that this is such a success. Yes, and I'm really, we are I'm very so proud. excited because we know this is going somewhere nice, somewhere yeah. that's gonna benefit. And um, yeah. This idea, we want to create that kind of challenge where other celebrities do the same thing. Yeah, you guys, know, connect yeah. with Elina. Unfortunately, I won't be here for this. She'll come month. back for I'll this. Come back, I'm gonna be here. Uh, okay, we're gonna start shopping. Uh, after I buy the stuff, I'm gonna put them on, and I'm gonna post them. Mm -hmm. And yeah. Also, I really like this bag. Oh yes, we have accessories as well. Here we go. I'll show it. This bag, nice you can dress it up and down. I feel like yes. this is something people like, like yeah, the fashion jeans. people, like you say, like oh, you can dress this up. Yes, you can wear down. it with like a nice black dress and heels, go to like a nice wedding or something, or put it on with jeans and a nice white top or black top, and there you go, you got your casual look with sneakers. With sneakers, that's my kind of yeah, my kind of look. Your thing. Okay, awesome. Okay, I'm gonna shop. I'll tell you guys the final tally of what I buy. Yes, how much? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Okay, the floor is shaky a little bit. But guys, I just got a style upgrade. I'm gonna do unboxing with you. And then I'm gonna tell you how much everything cost me. So, first up is this brand new dress from Zara. It's like cute. It goes with my new commerce that I talked about. I'm very good at this unboxing things. Very natural for me. On the theme of stripes, I got this high-waisted shorts. Also goes with my new red commerce. I'm building my closet around my commerce. Okay. Next is that. Oh, it's also Zara. This is the shirt that you saw at the beginning of the video. And then the top that Elena recommended. Well, basically everything. She, she upsold me so much. This is totally my style. Like a crop top, casual, see-through. Yeah? I'm not even count. I lost count of how many items I got. And then this. I'm, I actually I was literally looking for something like this. It has like the cute little open sides. I don't know how to talk about fashion. And I end up getting the clutch. Oh, it also has a like you can also, you know, you know, crossbody or something. Okay, so let's count how many. 
items we got. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Four, drum roll, 15,000 dirhams, which is $30. I know, it's insane. And it's all going for a good cause. So anyway, come with me to say bye to people. Yeah, okay, so I wanna say thank you so much to these ladies for pulling this off. This is, is this made me happy. Uh, and after kind of being in kind of like a quarantine for two weeks, I'm super happy to be shopping right now. So thank you so much for doing this. Follow them on Instagram. I'll put their handles here on the screen somewhere. And. Together we'll say bye to people. Yes. Bye. bye.